Robert, congratulations on becoming Cardinal. Thank How do you feel? It's amazing. It's an uh, um, unexplainable feeling. Um, it's stoic. And, uh, I just can't wait to get there and get them to start on my career. Rob, what did you Have you heard from Arizona? Did you know that they were one of the teams that ran on you? Oh, yeah. I knew they were very interested in me. I mean, what, what all were they saying to you in your conversation? Did you feel like that was a good position spot for you? Yeah, they, 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 they said that um, they believed in me and that. I'll fit their team and their scheme very well, and, and they, they got good vibes for me when I went up there and got the same mm -hmm. special, special thing. How relieving is it to now have all of the process done? It is. It's yeah. been fun. And I can relax and focus on football and all matters and, and, and have a great career. And when you, when you answer the phone, who? That's a, that's a veteran defense. There's a lot of guys that I can, you know, look up to and, uh, and, um, and follow and, and, um, and just be a good asset and, and play my roles and, and be the guy that needs to be. When you answer the phone, who did you talk to? Steve. What did he say? Man, he, I don't know how to get down, man. <laughs> when I saw him being in Arizona, I was like, oh, man, this is it, you know what I mean? And, and it was just... I feel like you, you'll fit in there great with kind of a cast of characters and the head coach. It's a little quirky. Does that kind of fit your personality a little bit? It fits me perfectly. That's why they chose me because they saw that. Rob, when you signed with Ole Miss in 2013, did you ever see this day coming when you and two of your teammates would be first round picks? Um, I saw it, but it's different when you're here. It's, uh, it's surreal, you know. It's, I mean, it's, it's not the same thing as you know, saying, oh man, hey, we can. We Robert, were you concerned you might slide to the second round there? Is it? Um, I was concerned, but you know, that didn't really matter. You know, wherever I went was where I was supposed to go. You know, so it's here. You know, it's the Cardinals. I'm happy. Did you get any feeling during the draft process that Arizona may be a potential landing spot for you? Oh yeah, I did. I did. I had that back in my mind. I was like, hey, Arizona Cardinals might be where I'm supposed to be. Me and my agent and my family were like. Everything, you know, the people I've been coach Bud, Steve, Bruce, everybody, Mike, everybody that I talked to that had those those comforting vibes and you know, they didn't judge me, you know what I mean? And, and they were, you know, mature people and and, and it's where it's where I'm supposed to be and, and I'm happy about it. You, so, you said some you said they didn't you said they didn't judge you, which is a big deal. Yeah. Does that make you want to now Wreck the NFL like we talked about yeah, before yeah, on their behalf. They're, they're fired. As a re yeah, they're more on fire because you know they trusted me and I want to give back every inch of my soul to show them, hey, where I die and I can't wait to do it. Rob, what was your reaction to everything that everything went through tonight? It's heartbreaking because not all that dude and he's such a good person. I hate to see something like that happen, but it's, it's already in the past. You know what I mean? He's already looking for it, and, and I'm happy for him, and I'm happy for his family, and, and I can't wait to see what he, what he does in the NFL. What did it mean to you? What did it mean to you yeah, after kind of the way things ended? That Coach Freeze stuck with you, was here tonight, and that kind of thing. Yeah, I mean, Coach Freeze is a great dude. Uh, me and Coach Freeze had a great relationship for a very long time. I love him to death, man, and, and that's, that's my dude, man. He's always stood next to me, and, and he's never, you know, Judge me for shying away. You know, I do on my side, and, and I'm over for that. What you, kind of defensive player are the Cardinals getting? Oh, um, they're getting a, getting a great player, disruptive player, um, aggressive player, best balls ahead of me. You know what I mean? I'm gonna keep evolving. I'm gonna keep, you know, finding ways to get better as a player and, and, and a person. And, and um, it's gonna be a beautiful thing, and I can't wait to do it. After after Hugh sat you down for the Sugar Bowl. Did you worry that it was going to affect the relationship? I don't know what you say about that. After Hughes had you down from the Sugar Bowl, did, did you worry that that would affect your relationship? Um, no way. 
you know, because I'm a, I'm, a, I'm a guy of understanding. I understood that's what he had to do for the betterment of the program and everybody else. You know, he had to use me as an example for the, you know, for the younger kids and 